Do you want your initiative to last? If so, start with that in mind. Start in a sustainable way. Some people are overambitious. They want something big. And so they get on the treadmill of applying for one financial grant after another. But what happens when the money runs out? They find their ambitions have jumped ahead of their resources. So start small. Jesus said, God's kingdom is like a tiny mustard seed. Christ values little beginnings. Be realistic about your time commitments. You budget your money, so budget your time. Use the guide to think about how you can pray, plan and lead your initiative in the time you have available. Be careful not to wear yourself out. Simplify, then simplify, then simplify again. It's a brilliant way to save time. If you host a community supper, for example, don't include a Christian talk. That takes time to prepare. Use one of the Bible study approaches explored elsewhere. They don't need any preparation and they're dead easy. Apply the motto, keep it simple, stupid, to everything you do. Keep asking for help. One group of families said, community is not our community unless we can help lead it. So share out the tasks. You'll build community and lighten your load.